Just, I want to introduce you to Thomas and uh, good afternoon. Thomas, I present? Yes. Commander Smith, very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Ian Ferguson. Mr. Ferguson, nice to meet you. With the current cost of a college education, almost the necessity to have it coming out of high school, especially if you're looking for higher education, college debt and student debt is a huge thing. And this scholarship gives those students the ability to not worry about loans each year, having to reapply for FAFSA. They just are able to focus on their studies and achieve what they want to do, what they want to get out of life. And the Navy's ROTC scholarship really gives them the ability to just go ahead and focus on being a student first and then giving them a great career opportunity afterwards. Naval officership is about character and courage and duty. I trust and I know that you are very well prepared for this. I work one-on-one -on -one with the applicants to ensure that they're able to get through the application process. So they start off with an online application and then I take over from there and I work with them to get their teacher evaluations done, their essays written, I'm their single point of contact for their officer interviews and everything like that. And then I'm able to get their officer application submitted and then let them know, hopefully, that they were selected for that $200,000 scholarship. But this is great. This is great. And uh, he's a great selection. Wonderful. Well, well deserved. The program itself, there's a couple different options for students. So whether or not they are huge into STEM or if they want to be a nurse or linguistics, anything like that, the NROTC scholarship has options for them. So we have a Navy option and a nurse option. So if they want to get their BSN, we have the opportunity for them to do so and do it without any incurring any kind of debt or anything like that. And then their commission as an officer right after, working in some of the most state-of-the-art military medical facilities across the country and across the globe. And then also the Navy option. So whether or not they're into aviation or nuclear engineering, we have those opportunities for those students to pursue their higher education, uh, incurring no costs to them and able to, get, once again, get a job right out of college, as many people have begun to realize isn't the easiest task. This will be my second season being the NROTC coordinator for the NTAG. So um, it was a pleasure last year. I worked with over 200 applicants. Uh, and we were able to get 46 of them selected for the scholarship. And seeing the expression on those parents, those teachers, and those students' faces, being able to like say, like, I got this scholarship. They put in the effort. They stayed after school to do extracurricular activities. They were studying. It wasn't me doing that stuff. It was them. I'm just happy that I'm able to help them with this opportunity.